can go either side. So he's going to be an exciting addition, I think, for the Whitecaps. These two expansion cousins back in 2011 now entering their second decade in Major League Soccer. And although it's the first competitive game, quite a few Vancouver players have been involved for this national team squad. Really impressive, great personality and can be dangerous going forward. Christian Gutierrez. Here is Gutierrez. Gives it away to Jimmy Chara. Claudio Bravo. A 24-year-old Argentine defender targeted allocation money signing from the Argentine Superliga back in December. Yeah, a player that loves to get forward, loves to... ...to Santos about what he wants to see in his continued growth in this team. He says he wants to grow in his personality. He said sometimes he's too nice. And he's actually better than sometimes he believes that he is. Michara looking to turn here against Christian Gutierrez. The block in, sends it behind for a goal kick. Yeah, it was nice play, nice little give and go. It'll be Baldissimo's delivery. Williamson clearing it away first time, and then Portland get it away again before Caicedo drives it back in. Here comes Felipe Mora. Christian Dahomey. Bravo trying to get back, as Dahomey will carry this towards the edge of the box. Slides it across for Daiba Caicedo. Daiba Caicedo with a strike, and Clark able to get down. Uh, good play, good counter-attack. Intelligent enough to drift into the middle, not a bad strike, he hits the target, but not really troubling Steve Clark. I say, no rolling it into the feet of Lucas Cavallini from distance. Promising again, though, a nice little... Portland through to uh, CONCACAF Champions League quarter-final against Club America. So a big test coming their way after the 7-2 aggregate win against Marathon of Honduras in the round of 16. Should have probably ran at Andy Rose, tried to attack the Whitecap central defender. Mora lays it off to here towards Diego Valeri, and Valeri puts it wide. This is the final game of Major League Soccer's opening weekend of the season. Game number 13 is Gutierrez just inside the Portland half here in the 19th minute of play. No goals so far as Cavallini slides it against Jimmy Chara. He wanted the free kick but nothing given by Alan Chapman as it's not long towards Felipe Mora. Oh, he's definitely number one choice and I think there's a bit of a battle there on for the, the partner alongside Godoy. A bit of a late one there from Veselinovic. No need to make that challenge but yeah Godoy will be the number one when he's fit and I think there'll be a battle between Veselinovic, Andy Rose and Derek Cornelius to, to partner alongside him. A couple of targets forward from the back as Prepo will try and climb and get there. Ichara, and he couldn't get away from the defender on the edge of the box. Gutierrez knocks that one in, it goes off Chara once again. Caps winning their first four openers, which was a record in Major League Soccer until LAFC tied it yesterday. Mora pulling it back towards Chara, Diego Chara that is. Williamson gets the ball back and then gives it away. It's not very progressive, it seems to be pretty safe and eventually this happens where they lose possession, Portland can then go in the counter-attack. Can they just be a bit braver with stepping into things or Awaiting the delivery from Baldissimo. The outswinger in towards Cavallini, who climbed well. Comes back here for Russell Tybert. All bunched in along the goal line there. Including Andy Rose right by the keeper as Baldissimo's ball comes in. Couldn't quite get a flick onto it. Controlled as well to bring it down, get his body there and win a free kick. Dahomey linking up there with Caicedo, whose ball into the box goes off Bravo and out of play for a third Whitecaps corner. Gutierrez gets a foot in there to put it out of play. Spring in the step there as Valeri rolls it in towards the edge of the area. Mora trying to play it through. Baldissimo brings it away for Vancouver. Extremely hard to really utilise that space if it appears. It's driven from distance and Crepal has to tip that one over. What a save. There is a spree. What an effort that is. The post sees it moving all the way. 
Commanding figures of the central defenders, Mabiala and Zuperic. All in there awaiting this for Larry deliveries. It's curled in and headed wide by Aspria. Aspria's ball in. Rose getting a strong header away. Terrific header. Valeri standing over this free kick as it swept in towards the back post. Charis header across goal. Crepo played well. And then the acrobatic attempt from Darren Aspria. Too deep here, the white caps don't like it at all. Leaves. Chara on the back post all alone. Does it really need to be that acrobatic? I'm not so sure. Go with the head there probably, but makes a nice connection, just doesn't get over the top of it. Have those two extra competitive games in their legs. But you wonder if at this stage of the season there could be some tiring legs towards the end of this 90 minutes. Mabiala got it away. Tybert helps this one in. Comes the way of Andy Rose for Vancouver. Great footwork from Rose and Whitecaps off the post. I thought it was going to creep in for the first goal of the season. Centre forward the way that he took that. And in the end, it's a little bit of a ricochet. Just comes off the right side of the post. Cavallini, who's alert and on. Agonisingly close. Gutierrez will take the corner in towards that back pass to the bullet header. Lucas Cavallini has the Whitecaps' first goal of the season. National to get his goal scoring off and running in the 2021 season. Brilliant ball to the back post from Gutierrez. Marking is shocking from the Timbers, but Cavallini won't care about that. Terrific header. We talked about service coming into the big striker and how if he gets the deliveries, he won't let his side down. He does it there with a really powerful clinical finish at the back post. Big stages before in their career in the NASL in the final couple of times, that's Baldissimo getting a yellow for the challenge on Williamson. No, it's a bad tackle, missed time from Baldissimo, just side down. Caicedo both combining to win it back for Vancouver. Cavallini battling there against Zuperic and he gets the free kick and a yellow card coming for Zuperic, who had been warned by referee Alan Chapman. Larry brings it down for Portland. Valeri trying to squeeze it through for Williamson and Rose oh, coming in with the challenge there. A little bit of a strange when usually goalies try and stay in there. Larry's ball in towards the back post and they'll get the corner here, Portland. Too deep again from the White Caps. I don't know why they drop off so far. Here's Valeri into the path of Jimmy Chara. He's got support from Diego Chara to the right side and this one's all the way for Felipe Mora. Great block. Good to hear this. what a block. Casado's still got a spark, the homie. Baldissimo's delivery towards the penalty spot with Rose, and it's knocked in by the homie. It's a second goal for Vancouver. And they are closing in on an opening day win against their Cascadia rivals, the Timbers. He's got to have a look. Yeah. That too much in effect on where the ball went, where the ball dropped. Definitely unintentional. Natural position for me is he's jumping for a ball. Gonna take it off, isn't he? It won't count. Christian Dahomey denied his first of the campaign. I thought I was gonna sleep easier knowing that it wasn't a handball, but I don't understand that. You can start in an offside position. Here's an opportunity as Rose looks to get it away, as Mora was what not far chance. away there. What a chance for Mora. The height of Joan, one of the targets in there. Loria swings this cross deep towards that back post, and Tuiloma heads it wide. It was a bit too deep from Loria. It's an opening day win for the Whitecaps. 